Here at WTOL 11, we want to thank you all for supporting St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. This video right here was before it was completely finished. You can now start touring the dream home hosted by Buckeye Real Estate Group. Let's check in right now with First Alert meteorologist Chris Vickers on what you can expect when you come to the home. Chris, every room you show us just keeps getting better and better. What can we uh, see when we go there today? You're going to see, Kaylee, a gorgeous dream home, a dream home that was built by this community, by Buckeye Real Estate Group, with so many people that have volunteered their services and their talents, and it has just come together in a spectacular manner. And out here today, you're also going to meet some of the volunteers that are going to be part of some of the open houses. I've got the Knights of Columbus from Perrysburg, and they're out here. They're volunteering, making sure everything is going smooth, and really have a big soft spot for volunteering and being part of the community. Community. I've got Dennis Balecki here. Dennis, you're with the Knights of Columbus in Perrysburg. Volunteering is part of what you guys do. This seems kind of like a natural fit, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. We, we do do a lot of fundraising for different charities, and that's really the mission of the Knights of Columbus is to provide help to the needy. And locally, St. John's uh, Parish Knights of Columbus Council has done a lot with the local, local groups. You guys have fundraised basically year round to help support this St. Jude Children's Research Hospital and specifically this year's uh, focus on making it a zero cost build. We were able to obtain that again in part because of your generosity and your volunteering time. You guys have a big presentation that is prepared for us today and we're happy and proud to reveal this. Dennis, tell us what the Knights of Columbus has done to achieve this goal. Well, what we have done is uh, various types of uh, raffles to uh, support uh, the funds uh, for our contribution to you and other activities we've been part of. We do a lot of volunteer work and sometimes we, we get uh, a little stipend for it, which we put in the pot, and then that's all part of uh, us to give back to charity. And this is a check presentation today to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital and specifically to make this a zero cost bill. So you guys are not only out here volunteering your time today, but also showing that you believe in this mission of St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. What does it mean to all these guys out here, this brotherhood of uh, gentlemen that are out here supporting the kids and families at St. Jude? What message is that? Speak well, to? I, I think one message is, is that we, we all kind of collaborate and look for a charity that we think is very important to the community, but to people, and uh, St. Jude is just one of those. I mean, what they have been doing in terms of their research uh, for childhood, uh, child Ill illnesses and, and different types of uh, research to prevent Things Absolutely. occurring works well. So. Well, you guys, I really appreciate not only you volunteering your time, but helping to make this year a zero cost build. That means more money goes directly to the kids and families at mm -hmm. St. Jude. And we raised $1.6 million this year. And guys, we did it in record time, selling out those tickets faster than ever. They are gone. Tickets are sold out, but your chance still to come out to visit for free. You could tour the St. Jude Dream Home. We're at 1009 Stonely in Perrysburg. Directions and the address on our website, WTOL.com. And a huge thanks to our Knights of Columbus volunteers that will be out here for today. Come on out and say hello. And I'll be out here for several more hours. I'd love to meet you as well. And your chance to win $10,000 in Lazy Boy Furniture just by touring the St. Jude Dream Home giveaway. Kaylee, it just fills my heart to see people with the generosity giving back to this community and making this such a great cause. Definitely does, Chris, knowing that um, all of these people here really support. I just saw, you know, $2,500. They really yeah. back this organization and what we do here in this community. The generosity fills my heart. It absolutely does just to see people come together. And I will say this, we could not do this without the generosity of this community. And that comes from Danny Thomas. Danny Thomas grew up here in Toledo, started St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. And I truly believe I see it every year. His generosity, it lives on today in what we do. Absolutely. Thanks so much, Chris.